1079 and this is another episode of Through My Eyes. So on today's episode, we're going to be talking about uh, a topic that I came up with. Uh, forgiveness is for yourself, not the other person. And the concept behind that type of thinking is like uh, people wound us every day and we wound people too. You know what I'm saying? With our words, you know, our thoughts and our deeds. And then we hold those resentments in our hearts. And sometimes they live in our minds. Like, you can see a person that did something to you. like, well, I hate that bitch-ass nigga. Oh, look at that punk-ass bitch. You know what I'm saying? So, that anger, that hostility, that uh, whatever it is, resentment, right, it holds us hostage. So, in order for you to be progressive in your life and be able to reach your full potential mentally, emotionally, spiritually, and every other possible way, you got to be able to forgive the people who come across your path with poor intentions. You know what I'm saying? you got to be able to forgive them. And it's not for them. It's not like to try to reconciliate with somebody or try to regain a friendship. It's to move on in your life. Because as long as you got an open wound, you're not healthy. You know what I'm saying? You're not healthy if you got open wounds. So in a beautiful world, like people that did you wrong, that it would never happen in a beautiful world. And then if somebody did inadvertently or whatever hurt you, they would have the decency to come and try to repair that on their own. That don't happen a lot. But you can't allow, like, uh, somebody else's indiscretions or imperfections to, like, slow you down, to slow your progress, progress down. So that's the thought. Like, you know what I mean? For forgiveness is for you. Like, forgiveness is for you. It ain't got nothing to do with the other person. It's just so you can be in peace with yourself and that you can use all your energy towards production. You know what I'm saying? That's what type of, like, thoughts, like, it's so much shit that happened in the course of a lifetime, right? And you can always go back and think about everything that went wrong in your life, whether it was a direct hit or indirect hit or whatever. You can think about this shit. Like, you can um, always relive that same amount of emotion, especially if it's a negative emotion. It's always easier to pull back that negative emotion. So as long as you can do that, like, a girl hurts you, right? Some female broke your heart or whatever like that. So a dude first mind is to get revenge, like, oh, fuck that. I mean, ain't nobody never going to do me like that anymore. But what if the next one is your queen, though? Like, what if the next one is your queen and you still got this hostility and resentment against somebody that's already out of your life? And now that ghost come back to haunt you in the present and destroy what was potentially what you wanted the whole time. So you got to keep your spirit pure. You got to cleanse your soul. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm sorry that you didn't see my vow. I'm going to forgive you like in the Bible. That's what Jesus said. Forgive them for they know not what they do. They had them stretched out. And he was still saying, they don't even know what they're doing, man. They, they of the earth. You know what I mean? So when you elevate it and you levitate it, you feel me? It's going to be situations like that. But in order to, like, pull your, harness your energy, you got to be able to forgive and move on. It ain't even about the person. It's about the principle, and it's about progress. Life is about progress. The only thing that stands still is trees. You know what I mean? And that's what it is, man, and I appreciate y'all rocking with me. The numbers is amazing. I'm grateful for everybody that's checking us out, supporting the team, and everything else. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and definitely share this with anybody that you think may need to hear a message like this. Um, got a couple of more episodes to go. And um, this will this season will be over. Coming back with another season, we're going to immediately roll into it. If you guys got any ideas or things you want me to talk about, you got any questions, you got any comments, don't hesitate to reach out to me. Check out the membership program. We got uh, sweaters. We got, we got stuff for y'all. You know what I'm saying? Uh, join the team. You know, join the family. Uh, and we out.